Every year, Apple tells us the iPhone camera is the best ever. But what's actually inside that tiny black circle on the back of your phone? How can something smaller than your thumbnail capture Hollywood-level videos, cinematic photos, and even night skies full of stars? The truth is, your iPhone camera isn't just one lens. It's a miniature factory of glass, sensors, and computer magic, all squeezed into a space thinner than a coin. Today, we'll peel back the layers and reveal what's really inside your iPhone camera lens. Section 1. A lens that's not just a lens. When you look at the back of an iPhone, you see one, two, or even three round black circles. You might think each is a single lens, but in reality, each circle hides a stack of five to seven ultra-thin glass or plastic lens elements. These tiny pieces are shaped with microscopic precision to bend and focus light onto the sensor below. The crazy part? Each element is thinner than a strand of hair, but together they fix distortions, sharpen edges, and reduce color fringing. Think of it like a team. One layer might fight glare, another might sharpen detail, and another balances colors. All this happens before light even reaches the sensor. And that famous portrait mode blur you love? That's not just software trickery. It's the result of these lenses controlling how light scatters before your iPhone's brain enhances it further. Did you know there are actually multiple lenses inside what looks like just one camera circle? Section two, the sensor, your camera's digital retina. Behind the lenses lies the sensor, the heart of your iPhone's photography. Imagine it as your camera's retina, catching light and turning it into digital information. In modern iPhones, Apple uses CMOS, complementary metal oxide semiconductor sensors. Each sensor contains millions of tiny pixels, not the pixels you see on a screen, but photodiodes that capture photons of light. When light hits them, they convert it into electrical signals. The iPhone 14 Pro, for example, uses a 48 megapixel sensor. But here's the trick. Your photos don't come out as massive 48 Manopur images. Instead, Apple uses a technique called pixel binning, combining four pixels into one super pixel to gather more light. That's why low light shots look brighter and clearer. And remember night mode? That's the sensor working overtime, capturing multiple exposures in fractions of a second, then merging them into one bright, detailed shot. Do you think more megapixels really mean better photos? Or is it all about how smart the sensor is? Section three, OIS, fighting your shaky hands. Ever wondered why your photos don't always come out blurry, even if your hands aren't perfectly steady? That's thanks to OIS, optical image stabilization. Inside the lens, housing are tiny motors and magnets that literally move the lens or the sensor in real time. If your hand shakes a little, the system compensates by shifting the lens in the opposite direction. This happens up to thousands of times per second. Apple has even introduced sensor shift stabilization in newer iPhones, where instead of moving the lens, the sensor itself floats and shifts to counteract motion. This technology was once only in professional DSLR cameras. Did you know your iPhone's camera lens is actually moving inside while you're taking a picture? Section four, filters and secrets between the glass. Between the lens and sensor are hidden layers that most people never hear about. Infrared filter stops IR light from hitting the sensor so your photos don't look unnatural. Color filter array, the Bayer filter, splits incoming light into red, green, and blue so your sensor can reconstruct full color images. Microlenses, tiny lenses sitting on top of each pixel, helping capture as much light as possible and guiding it to the right spot. And then there's Apple's secret weapon, coatings. Each lens element is coated with nanometer thin layers that reduce reflections, improve contrast, and help with tricky lighting. Like when you're shooting against the sun? That's why photos from iPhones often look punchier 
compared to cheaper phones with the same megapixel count. It's not just the number of pixels, it's the secret glasswork and coatings in between. Have you ever noticed those weird little flares or rings of light in night photos? That's your lens coatings at work. Section 5, the brain behind the lens. Here's the twist. The magic of iPhone photos doesn't stop at the lens or the sensor. In fact, most of the heavy lifting is done by your phone's A-series chip, the same chip that runs apps and games. Apple calls this computational photography. When you press the shutter, your iPhone doesn't just snap one photo. It captures multiple frames in milliseconds, some brighter, some darker, some sharper. Then it uses AI and algorithms to stitch them together into one perfect shot. That's how features like Smart HDR and Deep Fusion work. Your phone analyzes each pixel, reduces noise, enhances textures, and balances skin tones. Even the cinematic mode video blur is a combination of lens optics plus real-time AI depth mapping. In short, your iPhone isn't just a camera, it's a mini supercomputer that paints a picture using both light and math. Do you trust the iPhone's AI to make your photos better? Or do you prefer full manual control like on DSLRs? Section 6. Fun Facts and Real World Triggers The iPhone camera is so precise that filmmakers have shot entire movies on it, including Tangerine, 2015, and Parts of Unsane by Steven Soderbergh. The glass covering your iPhone lens isn't regular glass. It's sapphire crystal, one of the hardest materials on Earth, just below diamonds. That's why it rarely scratches. Early iPhones in 2007 had just a 2 megapixel camera. No flash, no video, no autofocus. Compare that to today's iPhones that shoot 4K cinematic video with Dolby Vision HDR. In fact, your iPhone camera is so advanced that it has become one of the most used cameras in the world. Some studies suggest more photos are taken daily on iPhones than on all professional cameras combined. Do you think smartphone cameras will completely replace professional cameras in the future? So what's really inside your iPhone camera lens? Not just a piece of glass, but a world of precision engineering. Multiple stacked lenses, advanced sensors, stabilization systems, secret filters, sapphire crystal protection, and a brain that thinks like a photographer. It's not just a lens, it's a whole studio in your pocket. Now I want to hear from you. Which part surprised you the most? The moving lens, the coatings, or the computer brain? Drop your thoughts in the comments. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more hidden tech stories that reveal the secrets inside your everyday gadgets.